I'm Joel Posey and I'm here at the red carpet Events LA celebrating the Grammys and I'm here with the lovely Ellen Dubin. Hi. Hello. So uh, we got some angel devilishness coming on here. Can you tell me a little bit about uh, what it feels like to be all devilish? Well, I'm just devilish inside. I'm actually quite a good person in this show that I'm doing, which is called The Collector. But if you stay tuned a little bit later on, I may get some devilish traits. Oh. That's all I can say right now. So you're kind of sneaky and sly. I get there, yeah. yeah. It's a, so you're, you have that nice, beautiful smile, and then there's that little hint behind the eyes of your mastermind plan. That's right. How'd you know that? Or maybe you know, you maybe know that know type of personality. A little bit. Maybe it's on the inside, you know, the halo on top and mm -hmm. the horns holding it up. That's true. So what are some of the most exciting things about this season? Well, I think you're going to see, I have a son who's autistic and he's the son of the devil maybe so you're going to find out a little bit more about who the father is of the son and it's a really really unique fabulous storyline it's really kind of spooky and the son is going to start to do some crazy stuff and it's going to affect me and how I'm going to deal with him and I'm also running after the collector a lot the man who collects souls for the devil who by the way is dropped dead gorgeous right of yes course. he's very cute you can only so, assume he would be that's right? right so I run after him and there's going to be a lot of uh, conflict yeah, lots of tension yeah sexual tension oh, oh yeah awesome. you know when two characters fight on camera but really you know they want to do other things that's on right. camera that's They're right oh you got a it. long gazing look <laughs> at each other <laughs> what was your favorite scene to shoot oh i'd say the scene i just shot where he gets off a motorcycle to interrogate me and there's that tension that's going tension. on and we are arguing and fighting it's an episode I think it's episode eight. Episode eight. So you're gonna to have to look we'll out for that. We'll have to watch for that yeah. tension. Very sexy scene. So as an actress, what is the hardest thing for you when you come into a character like this that does have these fun kind of dimensions? You know what? I don't have any challenges in this role at all because my cast is so great that we just sort of work off each other and riff off each other and the chemistry is so great with the kid playing my son and the leading man and the other leading lady and the guest stars that basically I show up for work in my outfits and it's just, and just it's easy. Play. It's actually one of the best jobs I've ever had. That's fantastic. Yeah, yeah I'm very lucky. Of course. I mean, that's I think what everybody wants. That's right. So since we're celebrating the Grammys, who are some of the people you're hoping to, to win awards at the Grammys? And who kind of inspires you musically? Who do you get pumped up to for your roles? Well, you know what? It's interesting because when I'm doing roles, I'll play music. It's a very good question to inspire me, and it depends on the role. But I, I think Justin Timberlake is... He is really transformed. If you listen to his old music and then his new music, he's sort of kind of a throwback, sexy throwback to like Frank Sinatra, but yet he's got that sort of hip vibe. Kind of that and, newer, modern age yeah, too. Yeah, exactly. So I really love him, and I still love Rihanna. I think she's really great, and um, I just, I'm, I'm just love all kinds of music. I'm, re I'm just trying to think right now who I really want to win. What are Best you going to be doing for the Grammys? I'm actually going to be sitting at a friend's house and watching it with friends. This year, I went last year. This year, I'm not going. This so, year, but I'm doing a lot back. of events leading leading up to it, right. so, which is great. I your, mean, the music industry is incredible. Of course. No, what was um, your favorite thing that you've been gifted to so far today? I'd say a comfy pair of shoes. Oh, that's yeah. always what a girl needs. Cozy, snuggly shoes. That's right. They're padded inside, and I can run around. You take them. off the heels after a long day. Wear the comfy shoes. Exactly. <laughs> if we want to keep up with you online, where should we go? Well, there's three ways. At Jigarada is my Twitter. And Jigarada, it was the name of the first character I played in a sci-fi series. So it's at G-I-G-G-E-R-O-T-A. There's Facebook, Ellen Dubin. And there's www.ellendubin, E-L-L-E-N-D-U-B-I-N, dot -E -E com. There's always updates. I have a new zombie movie coming out. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of new things coming. Great. So you'll well, have a good time. I look forward to uh, hearing more about that. Me yeah. too. I look forward to talking to you again. Great. Thank you so much. So cute.